friends, denizens of the internet, hello and welcome back to another exciting episode here of Parasite Eve. I am Devo Lost Time Gaming. We are in the shoes of Aya Brea here. We just took down the T-Rex, and I assume that means we're going to go back to the room we got knocked out of by the Triceratops. And because we've kind of wandered around this uh, museum a million times, I'm just going to fast forward. I'm going to cut away until we get there, so you guys don't have to see me trudge through here again, because I assume there's still going to be random encounters and stuff. So I will be back once I get there, okay? All right. All right, so this was the room the Triceratops knocked us out of, so I assume this is where it wants us to go. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Maybe... Yeah, because we got the headbutt through here, which knocked us down to the ground floor. Oh, here we go. Yep, yeah, that was it. Right. Wait, I don't, I don't like the sound of that. Oh my, there's more of them in here? That's not good. No. Oh no. Oh wait, these... What the heck's going on? An earthquake or something, that's not good. Come on, those are millions of years old. Don't do that. What? Where am I now? What is this? <laughs> is this the room I was just in? Oh, okay, I get it. We came from down. Yeah, we came from that way. Alright, so we're going up these stairs. Right after a random encounter. <laughs> ah, pterodactyls and giant pill bugs, huh? Hmm, that's all you got? Okay, fair enough. I'll shoot the pterodactyl first. I can actually easily walk step away from the pill bugs as long as I'm not shooting already. There we go. Okay. Yep. Shoot them bugs. Shoot the bugs. Yeah, uh, shoot them. Wow. What's up with this bug? This bug's like refuses to die. There we go. <laughs> that bug was a fighter. He'll be remembered in the annals of bug history. As a bug who said no. Right, up the stairs we go. Up the gross stairs we go. Ugh. Oh, good. It's so gross everywhere. That's lovely. But all this is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's all fine and good here. Eve's on the other side. Okay, thanks for... Thanks for pointing that out. Maybe I shouldn't have gone this way. Maybe I was supposed to go the other way. Man, it's like a third boss fight in a row. Eve! Sweet cutscene. Oh, at least you're not like... No, you are. Well, thankfully you don't have any nipples. Therefore, you are androgynous. And not nude. You're like a mannequin. Oh, look, it's still gross, though. It's still... They're still not pleasant to look at by any shape of the uh, imagination. Yeah. Yeah, like I always said, your face is fine, but oh, don't give me the creepy shush. Oh, okay, that hung on that shot for way too long there, I think. <laughs> oh, it's not any better when the cutscene goes away. It's a wonder you made it this far. Hmm. So, are you going to congratulate me on this birth? What are you planning to do, Eve? Hmm. Perhaps you can help me answer that here. Why do humans give birth? Hmm? Maya. Oh, sweet. Back to the cutscene. <laughs> the polygon version of her was not pleasant to look at. You alright there, Aya? It looked like you were kind of transcending reality there for a second. Ugh. Oh, that's gross. What? What the heck are you doing? Hey, Eve, don't do it. No. No. Uh oh. Oh, that's bad. Yeah. Oh. Oh. That's... <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, that's pretty gross. Oh, okay. Oh, it's got hands. It's like the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, except... Embryonic fluid. Hmm. 
Oh, Kia, right in there. Oh, it's got bones, too. That's that's really, really gross. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that at all. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that pistol's gonna cut it, eh? The acid shotgun rifle, ice gun. That, that might work. Yeah, at this point, our weapon is kind of like the ZF-1 from the fifth helmet, basically. Just missing rockets. Wait, why are they just hanging around outside? Did they see the abomination burst in there? You okay, Ayo? Hey, uh... Daniel? Maida? You both made it out okay? Yeah. We barely made it, though. Did you see that ugly mama? That... That was everyone from Central Park. What? And you're saying that Lorraine's a part of that thing, too? I'm sorry, Daniel. Hmm. Er, yes, it has become apparent as to what medication Melissa had been taking. What was she on? Crack cocaine. <laughs> she was being administered immunosuppressants. Immunosuppressants? For what? Why? I, I don't know. Why? I guess Maida's gonna tell us. After we get in the car. <laughs> Here's the story. Melissa had a transplant when she was a kid. Transplant? What kind of transplant? Yes, it seems that she got one of your sister's kidneys after Maya died in an accident. A kidney transplant? So Melissa got Maya's kidney? Okay. That would explain the... I would explain some things. Your mother and your sister were donors. What? Really? Never knew that. Your mother's organs couldn't be transplanted after the accident, so my kidney was transplanted into the young Eve. No, I'm sorry, the young Melissa. She had kidney failure. Then Eve's kidney is really Maya's kidney? The intern that was present at the operation was, you guessed it, knocked a clamp. Hans Clamp, our main man, Clamp, wanted to become a doctor. The doctors that were present during the operation were all surprised and they all screamed that the kidney was hot. <laughs> this kidney is on fire! <laughs> then, Eve is. It's hard for me to say, but the original was present in Maya. Eve killed the host brain, cultured the kidney, and obtained her own physical body. Then that's what happened to Melissa. In her case, the immunosuppressant drug served to act as a catalyst. In Japan, Eve targeted a girl who had undergone a transplant, a kidney transplant to be exact, and she was taking the same immunosuppressant drugs. This was also that Eve would have a uterus to plant the fertilized egg. Ugh. I like the air quotes around the uterus there, that's good. In order to transplant organs, it is necessary for the HLA type to match. It lives symbiotically with other cells, so it's necessary to take immunosuppressants to control the immunity and avoid rejection. While being controlled by Eve, Melissa felt her body change, but she finally got the lead part in the opera. If she had gone to a doctor, she would have been told to give up the part. So in order to avoid rejection, she kept taking the drugs, and after taking so much... She was so weak that Eve was able to take over her physical body. And that's how she transformed into mitochondria Eve. So then, Maya is... Maya's the original Eve? In reality, it's Maya's mitochondria. Now we're back on the... Yes. Roger. Commencing operation, sir. Finally, the time has come to put our power to the test. Don't be impudent, Lynch. It shouldn't have come to this. Y yes sir, forgive me, Admiral. Calling all fighter jets. We have just received permission to attack. Commence operation. Head for the Statue of Liberty. 
As planned, Helicopter Team 1 will prepare for Plan 2. Team 2 will search and the rest will do their best to impede further advancement. Okay. <laughs> cool story, bro. Oh, sweet aircraft carrier. Alright. That's all fancy and good. Go oh, back in the car here. Okay. <laughs> what? Are you sure? The Navy's made their move. What? We can't allow this. We'll be repeating what happened yesterday with the jets. Oh yeah, the one that almost dropped on top of that building at us. Oh, sweet cutscenes. You got their Apaches? All right. Oh, it's gross. Why is it shooting beams of light? I don't think... Well, that's probably not good. Ugh, what's... what's it doing? That doesn't look good. Kind of turned into a sphere there. No! The rain! The rain can't be a part of that thing. This huge creature, or no, those cells. That must be where Eve's giving birth. Where's she giving birth? I, uh, yeah, she just said. Or he just said, yes, the huge creature will act as a barrier to protect the ultimate being. Oh, okay, gross. That's why it's all bright and semi-electric looking, I guess. Oh, take that. <laughs> maybe the jets will fare better. I mean, they didn't last time, but maybe they will this time. Missiles away! Oh, that, that's no good. They just kind of nope over here, little blown up buildings and stuff. Oh! Yeah, that, uh, you are dead. <laughs> hey, somebody was smart enough to be like, oh, no. I was gonna say, somebody was smart enough to get the heck out of there, but no. Rain. The helicopter's coming. Hey, yeah, you should probably. Everyone, duck, cover your heads and. Meta's <laughs> just like, oh, we're all gonna die. They're both like, no, we're not, Meta. Be quiet. You're ridiculous. Oh, I thought I was playing the game for a second there. Holy crap. The helicopter didn't crash. Officer Bray of the NYPD, correct? Ma'am, it's my duty to accompany you to the aircraft carrier. Accompany her? To the what? Oh, I, I didn't do his voice there, sorry. <laughs> uh, sometimes I forget because Daniel's one of the few that gets a voice. Him and Clamp, basically. Welcome aboard the Navy's pride and joy, the Nimitz. I'm Williams. I command this ship. Sorry to have you come at such short notice. Hey, you better not put A in danger here. You, who do you think you are talking to the Admiral that way? It's quite all right, Lynch. After all, he is right. What? What do you mean? You're the only one that can't be ignited by her. I'm asking you to get in our chopper and nuke the creature. What? <laughs> Hold on, A can't fly a helicopter. Not to worry, the chopper's been set to auto. She won't have any problems. What? So she just needs to fire from a distance? Where she can't be ignited? Unfortunately, the weapon needs to be fired at close range in order to work. And we cannot move in that close since we will be ignited. Okay. Well. Well what? Okay. <laughs> I'll do it. Hey, no way, you're not going up there. Our fate lies in your hands, Al. Okay, Daniel. That, that thing, that's not Lorraine. Do it for Lorraine too, Al. Wait, hey, please take this. Uh, Maida, I swear to God. Come off it, man. We don't have time for that right now. 
Yeah, thanks, Daniel. Yes, of course, sir. Uh, Aya, please be careful up there, okay? How many of those things you just carry around, Maida? Of course, I'll be fine. I mean, you won't. You're flying a helicopter to nuke a giant monster. I don't... I don't see how that's gonna be even, you know, on the spectrum of fine at all. Maybe on the spectrum of not fine? Maya. We have liftoff. Let's go nuke that giant abomination. Why are there other helicopters coming with us? They, they literally all just exploded last time. Wow, no cruising. Yeah, I don't think helicopters move that fast, but okay. Or would fly that low to the ground. What the heck? Man, we are just freaking... Are these jets or helicopters? I'm confused. <laughs> I mean, this is a pretty sweet cutscene, I'm not gonna lie. This stuff was mind-blowing when it came out. Blowing the mind. Uh-oh. The creatures within view switched the formation to... I do that. Formation 2 is a straight line, apparently. <laughs> what? What's happening here? From the last battle, we are able to anticipate this attack. We're positioned this way for a reason. What do you mean? That way we don't all instantly die. Oh, well, <laughs> yeah, they're just... They're in, like, human shield formation. We will act as your shield so that you will live to attack the creature. Okay, that's... That's great. What? No, I'm not doing this without your... Yeah, man, you are dead. Hit it with the nuke. We're entering firing range. Prepare to attack. Alright. Please, move away from me. Now. We cannot abandon our duty. Besides, we are already within range. Hit him with that special something, eh? And by special something, I mean nuclear weapon. Or, you know, fly right through it? What the heck was that about? Hey, you're supposed to nuke it, eh? This is insane. Since Christmas Eve, I put a course, a curse on my own body. Why me? Why is this happening to me? I don't understand. But I don't care anymore. Because Eve, I'm the one that can destroy you. Once and for all. Maya, I'll end this and let you rest peacefully with this giant nuclear weapon. Candy Graham, coming in hot. Skadoosh. Oh, what a mess. What? I like how it covered the camera as if there was a camera floating in the sky there. Huh? Oh. oh, got all over the statue. Feel sorry for the person who's got to clean that up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, well, there go. There goes that. That is unfortunate. The legislature's gonna take years getting money to get that back up, right? We did it! Well done. That was magnificent. Return to base, eh? Huh? No, it, it's not over yet. Will they give you they give you a couple of nukes, eh? Huh? You got you got another nuke on there? Yeah, I was gonna say it doesn't Oh, oh that's not good. You got purple hands. That's strange. Oh what Oh. Okay. Hey, again, your face looks fine. It's the rest of you that haunts my nightmares. Daniel. Ta no, that's his name. Don't say it. Jeez. Hey, come back now. It's too dangerous to continue. Return to the base at once. We will plan. But will you save your progress? Yeah. Why? No, let's... Why did you ask me twice? Will you still save? Yeah. Why did you ask me twice? You're freaking me out now. We're gonna save it on the top slot, though. Just be on the safe side. 
file saved. Okay. Good. Yes, Aya, please, I need to give you... Another charm? Yes. Wait, what? Forget it. She signed off already. Sweet cutscenes. Should grab parachute? Oh yeah, that that pistol's gonna do you a whole lot of good, eh? I'm just gonna jump off this helicopter. Do helicopters come with parachutes? I don't think they do. Because isn't there like the chance you jump out of a helicopter and sucks you into the rotors? Isn't that how? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. I don't. I don't like this setup. We've got rockets, but no rocket launcher. Okay. Good. We've. This is all fine and good. I guess straightforward is our. Uh. 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 Uh, it's not getting better the further we go. Uh, 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 okay. So it was you. Oh, Eve, you are looking jacked up. Maya. Hmm. That must be the name of my host. Let me guess. Your sister. You have the ability to evolve. Why take the side of a doomed species? Humans aren't doomed. If my mitochondria has the ability to evolve, it'll evolve to get rid of you. <laughs> Love that sense of humor of yours, girl. Why is it that humans kill? Humans kill each other's creatures, and they even kill their own kind. We have our reasons, and you sure are a good enough reason for us to kill. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> All organisms have something called a territory. This territory is guarded from natural enemies. But until now, humans had no such natural enemy. That is what has allowed them to prosper to this point. You beings must think of your prosperity as history. But you're wrong. We mitochondria have lived within the human being and have allowed you to prosper. What? <laughs> we mitochondria have made you creature a perfect environment for us. Humans have come to rely on civilization and have lost touch with innate physical abilities. Can't you see that it's the perfect scenario? What? And you're saying that humans were kept alive for the mitochondria's sake? Hm. You humans just served as transportation vehicles for us. What do you mean? Vehicles that transport us to the time the mitochondria would become free again. <laughs> but you see, the vehicle is no longer needed anymore. From now on, the mitochondria will become human beings and will rule this earth. Well, that doesn't sound good. I'm... I'm sorry, Eve. I'm going to have to try and put a stop to that. Well, you got a little curly tail there. That's strange. Oh, we are right in it there. Okay. Right, and you're just shooting off explosions. That, that's very good. I'm gonna haste it. It's showdown time. Yeah, look at me run now. Now I'm greasy fast. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, could you not with that? Could you not with that? Let me... Alright, that's unfortunate. Yeah, shotgun. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna ask that you stop shooting me multiple times with large, large amounts of damage. Wow, wow. Okay, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to use another one of those right away. Because, wow, you... Ow, could you stop hitting me with that? You know what? Okay, well, I didn't realize. Yeah, okay. Yep, okay. That's... Just keep it up. Keep firing. Keep firing! So, you know what? We're gonna bust a barrier here. What is that? I don't like it. Oh. 
Oh, you're gonna do it again? Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Ah, uh, yeah, that's bad. Ow, ow! No, stop stabbing me with the stabby hands. Nope, that's bad. Run from that. I have to run from that. Okay, there we go. Nope, don't hit me with that again. That's gonna jack me up. Ow, ow, stop stabbing me in the brain. And then just set me back down real casual, like, thank you. I appreciate you. Nope, not this time. Aha! Man, I'll tell you what, this, uh, this spread shot's working out something... Something a real treat here. Nope. Oh, hey, watch where you're pointing that thing, chief. Barrier again, yes. We got, we got. Nope, none of that. Oh, I totally wasted a large chunk of that barrier just on one shot of that. Shoot her! Oh, Owzers, that tickled a little bit. Oh, no, we need to heal first, yep. Alright, well, we're out of med threes, that's unfortunate. Or med fours, rather. Kind of lost our parasite powers at this point, too. Yeah, we're gonna have to do an armor switch here. Just kind of scoot around. Hopefully we don't die. Ow! Stop it. Shoot the thing, Ash. Come on. Oh, 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 ow, 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 ow. Stop it. Another med three down the hatch. No, 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 no. Ow. It's like I'm doing damage, but you're not dead. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, I'm gonna need a big, big old honking heal here. There we go. You know what? We're gonna slap a barrier down too, just because uh, I guess I guess Eve has upgraded her melee strike. Yeah, clearly. Ooh, you made a funny noise there. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. Just <laughs> you're doing like the. Uh... Rotation, mega rotation death from uh, the series Bastard, the anime series. I love that. Hmm. All right. Well, that's not gonna work. Yeah. Let's. Uh, got two med threes left. One eighty. Yeah. Sure. Why not? I don't. I don't care. Pop it. Shove it down your gob. No. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> I gotta stop getting hit by that. That's bad. Okay. Pop him at three. And we have to do an armor swap again. No, 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 no. Get away from me. Oh. Alright. So we just gotta not die. We just gotta not die. That would be great. Hmm. Yeah. No, stop it. I need to live! I want to live! For the human race, we must survive! Oh? I think we pulled it off. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you your points for trying. But enough of this nonsense. Uh-oh. Watch and learn what evolution really means. Uh-oh. Oh, it's cool. The Statue of Liberty's face in the background there. Awesome shot. Hmm, stars in the sky. Oh, 
Well, you're slightly less ugly. Thankfully, you technically still are not naked because you're in genderless. Oh, I have, I have to fight you again. Okay, that's bad. That's the bad news. Yeah, I don't. I uh. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ow! Ah! What? Oh yeah, I forgot to look. What is this? Liberates mitochondria control. Yeah, it still doesn't. That doesn't help me at all. Okay, just checking. I just wanted to make sure. What? Ah, jokes on you. I can get rid of that nonsense. Yeah, I was gonna say, take your next attack. Uh oh. Whoa, okay, that's bad. Wow, okay, sweet, I dodged it. That's handy. Uh, I wanna die. Ah, I don't wanna die. Oh wow, that poison ticks off for a lot. Okay, we gotta heal or we're gonna die. We gotta heal or we're gonna die. I don't wanna die. Not in a two-stage boss fight. Man, this last like this last episode has been like nothing but just uh just boss fights over and over again. Okay, that's bad. Okay, I definitely got hit by that, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh man, that takes that takes a lot of parasite power. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, that's uh the armor swap. Wow, why am I? Oh, I'm slowed. I was gonna say why am I really slow, but it's because I'm slowed. Duh. Ow. Stop it. Stop hitting me with nonsense. See, there's that nonsense again. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna shoot. Yeah, what's up now? How you like that? I gotta bust a heal. Oh man, this is... I get the feeling this is going to be close. Ah, that tickled a little bit. And we definitely have to get rid of that defense down or we will be dead almost instantaneously. Oh man, why do you why do you have so many forms and so much life? Oh yeah, dodged it that time. Sweet. Shoot her air, shoot the crazy lady. I don't care about the slow, just keep shooting her. I'm gonna need a heal after this one. Heal the magical mitochondria healing. Nope. Why'd you stop moving like that? Ah, crap. Yeah, dodge that one. That's weird how it's like, yeah, you gotta dodge it even though you can't see where it's coming from. Like, okay, I, I guess. Run! Run, I am. Uh, run away from the giant explosive spear. Which looks like a, a, like a Neon Genesis Evangelion when they're throwing the, uh, the Lance of Longinus. <laughs> it's like, ooh, watch where you're pointing that thing. I don't know if I'm gonna dodge this one. Nope. Oh, come on now. That's cheating. I should probably do an armor swap too. Yeah, I have to. It's getting dicey. Because I can only assume 
Ah, come on, that's that's cheating. I can only assume that she throws her from like my last standing position. So I have to run as far away from po as possible from that, but or sometimes she just straight cheating. It's getting much faster. Nope, okay. Now let's go up left. Up left? I think we dodged it? No, we did not dodge it. Come on. I think the area of effect on that's getting bigger. That's also part of the problem. Come on, go away, go! Shoot her! Ow! No, don't do that. Why? Oh! Oh, man, we pulled off again? I... I don't understand. No, you can't be our natural enemy. No. I think I am. Yeah. How's it feel to be jacked up? Yeah, take that, you weird alien mermaid crow harpy thing. Oh, oh, what? Uh. Oh, now she got blue hands. Wait, what? Boom, yes. Are you dead? Oh, what the heck was that? I ask if you're dead and you give me a little. Oh, and I'm melting. I'm melting. Good. Wow, we pulled that off. There must have been some mitochondria that underwent a different type of evolution. Think about it, Eve. Oh, okay. Well, we'll, th we'll think about it. <laughs> Day six, liberation. Well, that was one heck of a ride there. Uh, and I think that's the first time And like, I played through this game a couple of times over the years since it came out, and I'm pretty sure that's the first time I've ever done that on the first try. And wow, awesome. I'm so glad I did because, oh boy, it, much like the last episode, this one ran long just in, uh, just on its own. So redoing that would have been a real pain. So awesome leaving into that. So, as usual, that's all the time I have for this episode. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining me. This is Parasite Eve in the shoes of A. Abrea. I am Devo at Lost Time Gaming. Thank you for joining me once again. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and get subscribed. And let me know down in the comment section below what you thought about my gameplay, the commentary, or anything else in general. That being said, thanks for watching. As usual, I'll catch you all on the flip side. Nope, nope, nope.